You are simply not going to believe the clip that I'm about to play for you. It's pastor, I hope I pronounced the name correctly, Lezego Daniel. He's the pastor of Rabboni Christian Center in South Africa. This pastor, you see him at the front of the church telling about a hundred people who look as if they're either demon possessed or they're in a hypnotic state. And by the way, hypnosis is used throughout many evangelical churches to control the people. They're controlled by the music, they're controlled by the atmosphere and the peer pressure, and they're controlled by the pastor's use of words. They'll shout out commands, stand up, sit down, repeat after me. I've seen stage hypnotists operate, and they operate just like many evangelical pastors. But this pastor, he's going to get these people who are either demon-possessed or hypnotized. You, you make up your choice. He's going to get them to go outside and eat grass. He believes it's some sort of spiritual food uh, that they need to eat before they take communion. Now, this is a five-minute clip. Watch it and weep. Because... I am just so incensed at this. I no longer call myself a Christian. People ask me, you know, I'm a Christian. No, I, I, I say I'm not a Christian. Because there is so much blasphemy in the evangelical churches. Any Christian pastor can teach whatever he likes. <laughs> you get to be an evangelical church pastor, you make stuff up on the hoof. You have a doctrinal statement of faith, which Todd Friel refers to as filing cabinet theology. In other words, you copy down something from a website, it's your doctrinal statement of faith, and if anyone challenges you, you say, hey, we're orthodox, this is what we believe. And then you file it away and forget about it, you don't care about it, you teach whatever you like, teach the sort of crap that you see on God TV. If you can't see that evangelical Christianity is the most demonized and satanic religion on earth, with the possible exception of militant Islam, then you literally have to be insane. You, you have to be nuts. Because if you compare the average Jehovah's Witness or the average Mormon, and, and, and they're, they're non-Christian cults, <laughs> okay? They deny the deity of Jesus Christ. They deny salvation by grace through faith alone. But if you can't see that evangelical Christian is the most demonic, the most wicked infection of the occult into Christianity, then, then you're frankly insane. Watch this clip. Watch the pastor use uh, hypnotic commands to control his followers to go out and eat grass, literally eat it. And if, if you don't come to the conclusion that really not just this type of Christianity, but frankly most Christianity, most Christians don't know what they believe. And, and, and you know what? Satan is ruling most of these churches. Oh, look, I, I, I'm just done talking. Here's the clip. Salve Jesus. Now, I get, we are supposed to eat the bread, but they're going to eat special bread before they eat this. If Jesus can turn water into one, fish into his body, huh? loaves from the boy into what? Into what? Into his body. People can eat. So I'm going to give them food from above. And they're going to eat for this year, 2014. Huh? Huh? Happy we are fasting, but they're going to eat the fulfillment from above. Wake up! Stand up! Stand up! Upright! Attention! Close your mouth. Okay, I see food outside. Look at that. Look at that food. Be quiet. Be quiet. Okay, go and eat. Go and eat. Go eat outside. Go quickly. Eat quickly. Eat quickly. Today, no time. No time. You eat quickly. 
limited time today I'm finishing now 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 to be calling you eat quickly <laughs> 